Yesterday's earthquake still on the minds of so many South Floridians after feeling some tremors in the Miami area. We got a lot of questions like, is this common? And is South Florida vulnerable to future earthquake damage? WPTV's first alert meteorologist James Whelan spoke with a geologist at FAU to get you some answers. We typically talk about hurricanes here in South Florida, but this 7.7 .7 earthquake in the Caribbean, which led to reports of tremors in Miami, have many of you concerned. This is far enough away. It was in a very good place as far as minimizing damage. With multiple fault zones in the Caribbean, it's prime earthquake territory. Oh my God. So should we worry about future tremors in South Florida? We are not on a fault zone. In fact, South Florida is one of the they call it a seismic without earthquakes. It's one of the most earthquake free zones in the world. This earthquake moved the earth more than 70 feet under the ocean. But why no tsunami? This fault is a strike slip fault, meaning the two motions are horizontal. That does not lead to displacement of water. However, Dr. Warburton warns we are not free from tsunami threats. As far as tsunamis go, I mean, the Canary Islands volcanoes if they slipped from mountain falls into the sea, and that would cause a tsunami that would probably cause catastrophic damage in Florida. He followed that by saying it's not very likely anytime soon. We have things to worry about. Sea level rise is certainly a threat. Storm surge from hurricanes, yes. I mean, these are big threats, and this is getting more and more important. I also spoke with an FAU engineering professor that said the systems used to withstand hurricane force winds on buildings also have the capability of resisting some seismic forces. James Whelan, WPTV News Channel 5.